Heidi ho there, friends and neighbors. Bobby here today. Hey guys, today we're going to paint some center caps. You can bring the camera down, let the good people see what we're doing. Uh, we have these center caps for our Ford F-150 and uh, we're gonna paint them black, gloss black today. And I'm, I'm just finishing up the preparation here. What I've done here today, I'll stop for just a moment just so I can show you. Each one of these center caps we've washed good with um, hot soapy water. We have went over each cap with a red scotch bright and soapy water. And it's actually scuffed, scuffed the, uh, the chrome a little bit to allow it to accept some paint. You really can't tell probably on the camera, but there is some scratching on there and we're gonna paint these today. And uh, what I'm using now is just some wax and grease remover on a paper towel. And we've already wiped down all of the uh, center caps and I'm just wiping off the heads of the screws right quick and we're gonna mix up some paint and uh, get these things painted today so stay tuned okay guys we mixed up a little bit of our um, acrylic urethane black here uh, three parts paint one part hardener and I went ahead and grabbed my smallest of paint guns here and it's just a little little very small gun since we're dealing with a little bit of material here. And uh, this one actually sprays really good. I've used it before on some base coat. So there we go. It actually fills our cup up. Well, we mixed up the minimal amount to do this job. So let's go out and spray it up. Okay guys, I'm gonna go ahead and start getting the coat on this thing. Actually, I think I need a little bit more pressure. I'm gonna get a coat on these uh, the heads of these bolts here too to hold them on. We get kind of a coat on them as well. And we're not trying. We're not worried about full coverage on the first coat. We just want to put it on without giving it any runs. Okay guys, we'll let that tack up for a little bit and we'll come back and shoot another coat. Coat number two. Come in here on these insides here. Just ignore the bark. Don't worry about it. <laughs> All right. We'll let that set a few. I might put another coat on. Coat number three.
Satan's getting ready to paint, guys. He's actually going to paint. Ooh, ooh, now move, move, move. Okay. Daniel is going to paint this little tool that we made for the stump run. Keep going. There you go. Good job. Whoa, whoa, stop. You got coverage. I'll try to get coverage everywhere, okay? Keep turning it around until you get a cover. Keep working with it. You can do it. Get a little closer. About six inches away. There you go. Keep it moving. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Back off. This is Nathaniel's first time painting, guys. All right, whoa, 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 whoa. You don't want to end up with no big runs in it, okay? You got to get the handle here, okay? There you go. Stop. Okay. You need to get up here, so you're going to have to, you're going to get a little bit of paint on your glove right there. That's okay, though. There you go. Oh, this is smart, huh? Yeah, keep going. Get a little closer, son. There you go. All right, go ahead. There you go. Good job. It's all right. When it gets covered, you stop. We'll let that dry a little bit, and then you can put another coat on, okay? All right, what do you think about painting, son? Pretty cool? All right. That's probably good right there. Wet it up a little bit more right in here. There you go. Keep it moving, Nathaniel. He's putting on his side. Whoa, whoa, that's good. That's good. There you go. Go up that way. Easy, easy. Now, you might want to turn it a little bit when you do that. Okay. That's good. Let's see what you got here. Let's put a little bit right here. Wet that up right there a little bit. Go down. See, kind of move like that. All you got to do is kind of one little pass, okay? Turn it around in your hand a little bit. If you need to, don't drop it. That's good. Whoa, yep, there you go. You go a little bit back that way. All right. Daniel, I think that looks good. What do you think about that, bud? Yeah. Tell the good people that you painted today for the first time. How about that? Yep. All right, folks, we want to thank you for stopping by today and checking out our little video. And uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Once again, here's Nathaniel's little paint job he put on this little tool that we made for the stump grinder. I think it turned out pretty good. I think our, uh, we'll, we'll, let's see. Nathaniel, you got anything you want to say, buddy? Nope. You don't? You want to say bye to the good people? Peace. All right, we'll see you next time, guys. Take care. Okay, folks, there you go. Three coats on these things. I think they're going to look pretty doggone good, especially when they're bolted up to our wheels. They turned out real nice. I'm tickled to death with them. I'm actually happy with uh, Nathaniel's little tool that he painted with the extra paint. That's actually the tool that we custom made for the uh, stump grinder, for the extra wheel we added to it. But anyway, folks, We'll see you next time. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Take care.